Uh, well, let's do it. We're going to jump in. We're going to talk about what are the top 10 commodity trading systems. We're in the middle of a, what you might call a commodity super cycle. So we're going to have a, a live demo of our AB systems, algo trading uh, for commodities. We're looking at futures markets. And that's what we're going to jump into today. But before we get started, remember, we're speculating, just like in trading places with the Duke and Duke and Valentine. So we are trying to make money, but there's always risk when you're making money. So as prices move up and down, we're speculating on that movement. But of course, we assume risk to make that happen. So do take a moment and look at that risk disclosure, please. It is important. And looking at the bottom sentence or two, all funds committed should be risk capital, never trade unless you're only using risk capital. And past performance is no guarantee of future results. And that's probably more important than ever with um, looking at historical performance on trading systems. So with that said, we're gonna do some robo trading, look at a new approach. I think it's gonna be something new for probably most of you. We're gonna look at about 1800 algo trading systems. You can click them on, you can click them off. And we're gonna show you how to do all that. You can diversify among global markets and all the risk and profit controls are automated. That's the whole idea between algo trading, auto trading, whatever you'd like to call it. It's all kind of the same thing. So diversifying across global markets or just even market sectors. Here's an example of why we like algo trading. Let's all look back here at March. Here we have the S&P 500 or substitute any stock index really. And you knew what happened, you know what happened in, in March and uh, 30, 35% drawdown. Meanwhile, here is the graph uh, of the VIX spiking. You're all familiar with the VIX index. It's not, if not, it's quite simple. It's just an indication really of uh, uh, really how, how much uh, volatility there is in the stock market based off of looking at uh, put volume and so forth like that. So that's what we want to look at with these algo systems. What, uh, what might perform well when traditional assets are not? And here's an example of one system. Remember, remember past performance is not guarantee future results, but here's the performance of a particular system in March uh, that we have access to. And I'm going to show you just a little bit. But so here you have this system doing very, very well. You see all the gains and losses here day by day and the accumulated profits and losses. And by the end of the month, uh, this thing did phenomenally well when traditional assets didn't. So maybe there's some more we can uh, do to take a deeper dive in just a moment. And like I mentioned, we're in the middle of a commodity super cycle. And you can see here the CRB index, the Commodity Research Bureau. That's a really an index of uh, the commodity markets as a whole and the aggregate. And of course, past performance does not guarantee future results when looking at these charts. It doesn't mean it's going to keep going up forever. On the other hand, I think we probably will <laughs> keep going up for a while. I mean, look at the dollar here. Uh, really, really uh, working its way lower throughout, uh, especially the last several months of this year. We're kind of getting a counter, ten, counter trend bounce uh, actually earlier today. And then, <clears throat> of course, it all went went uh, kind of back to where it had been uh, just as quickly. So we're gonna jump in and look at some of these markets, but stick around, we're gonna have this live demo and it is after hours. So I don't know how active the demo will be, but there'll, there will still be some things to sit, take a look at and see. We're gonna show you something worth over $21,000. We're gonna offer it to you at an enormous discount and even show you how, how to get on board and get involved for free. Remember markets are always correct and we aren't. So you don't want to argue with prices. It can be expensive trying to convince the markets that you are correct from Ed Sequoia. I remember reading him uh, 20 plus years ago. And don't fight the tape. It's another way of saying trade the environment, trade what the market offers you. You don't want to end up like this person here, six feet under, still thinking that uh, the market was wrong all the way. So a little bit about us. Uh, we are AltaVest. We're a brokerage firm since 1997. And there's a picture of us. So some of our colleagues down on the trading floor, trading uh, quite literally millions and millions of S&P options. Um, that's really uh, a, a large portion of what we do. And uh, beyond that, though, we're also doing algo trading as well. And we're going to show you that here. And I am Eric Gebhardt. I've been doing this almost 
approaching 30 years now. I have my license back in 1991. I have my BS in Business Administration from the University of Southern California. And this is the first time I'm showing this, but this is this made me laugh. I had to throw it in there. This is maybe 1994, uh, the brokerage firm I worked at. Uh, there's my picture in my little bio. I was working on the uh, Tech Notes Associate Editor and drawing charts and so on and so forth and doing analysis. So that was kind of fun. I thought I'd throw that in there. But I got started, my interest sort of peaked in, uh, back when I was in school, I had an investments course from uh, USC and here's my textbook and we were studying forward markets, futures and going through all the Black-Scholes models and this and that and the other. I found it actually quite compelling. We were looking at the time at crude oil, crude oil doubling in value, gold prices had jumped, Saddam Hussein had invaded Kuwait. So that's where um, you could say my interest was first developed and uh, I did get involved in the uh, securities industry uh, with my licenses there, but ultimately I found commodities just a bit more intriguing and that's where I have been since. So with that said, Let's jump into this real quickly here. Three trading secrets. Number one, experience does matter. You don't want to try to figure everything out by yourself. You know, you uh, you don't want to be one of those uh, pioneers with all the arrows in their back, so to speak. So I think it's a good thing to learn from others. You don't want to be that lonely mad scientist. This is from a great movie called Pi. You can see the stock ticker up here, trying to figure out the uh, the uh, the basically stock price is based on uh, ancient uh, biblical numbers and numerology, kind of fascinating. But what we've got to show you, it's built with experience, decades of input and industry um, veteran development. And number two, day trading, it's awfully difficult. And I know I've heard some of these presenters and they're all excellent. Don't want to take anything away from anyone because in fact, uh, when I'm talking about day trading, I'm not really referring to uh, that type of day trade. I'm referring to the person that you might see on TikTok saying, uh, you know, I've got a hot tip for you. That's not going to cut it, folks. I think we all know that. But look at this, three and a half to four and a half percent day trading success rate. Uh, this is from a person who used to basically instruct people for multiple years. So it's difficult to be successful uh, day trading. And here's another study from the Journal of Financial Markets. And it says here, less than 1% of day trader populations are able to predictably and reliably earn positive abnormal returns net of fees. So very interesting. And with that said, why is that? Well, I think because we all, we all kind of approach the markets with our own biases. Motley Fool points out three of them. I'm not gonna go into it, but it's always good to review confirmation bias, anchoring bias, and recency bias. We tend to do this. You've got the, the world falling apart and then this guy has blinders on and says the stocks are doing great. And you know what, that's been true for, uh, well, for almost, um, I don't know, multiple years now. All you do is buy the dip and hold on. It seems to work. Uh, of course, it won't work forever. We're in the middle of a, you know, obviously a big bull market now, but, Nonetheless, our emotions can get the, the best of us and they become our own worst enemy. We've all felt you know, fear, greed, hope, anxiety, frustration, all of it. I know I have, I feel it every day actually, even after 30 years. And uh, we have bad wiring according to Mark Lindheim. We have a built-in bias to make poor investment decisions. And you know what he's trying to say there? I think we can all relate. Uh, we sell the lows and buy the highs. Tried, it's hard to break those habits. Um, you, kinda, you need to fade your emotions is really what they're saying. But uh, that's why we like algos. Remember, they have no emotion and they are dominating the marketplace, dominating maybe 80% of the stock market, causing sharp drops and rallies. So you see these big moves like today, for example, you know, overnight, you have the S&P down 70 some points and uh, comes back to basically unchanged and then settles uh, I think 20 points lower. So uh, that's not really generated by people like uh, us, you know, the retail trader moving the market. That's all machine driven. Although there are probably are more retail traders this last year um, than we realize. But robot analysts here are outwitting humans on their investment picks. And I think we could probably all agree that uh, just a matter of time, right? You've got Deep Blue beating the chess masters now. So 
that's what we're competing with. And it's called revolutionary trading. And here's how it used to look. G grainy video I took years ago in New York. So that's uh, the NYMEX. I think they're trading uh, you know, metals and the softs and so forth. And it worked well, but now this is what it looks like. No emotion, automation, built-in risk controls. That's what it looks like now. So how would you use those algos to compete in the current environment? You'd wanna use something to basically join them, as they say, if you can't beat them, join them. So we have a solution for you, automated systems trading. We feel it's very user-friendly for either novice or advanced traders, and I'm gonna show you that. And you can filter uh, based on your personal, um, your, you know, your, your taste in terms of risk and reward, the type of market uh, system, or the market sector, I should say, you name it, you can go and filter and then end up with a universe of systems that suit you best. You can do it in just minutes a day and everything's automated. You just activate and walk away. In fact, we've had clients that uh, basically set it and forget it for multiple years at a time. And uh, it's available for any market condition. The, the computers don't care if the markets are moving up or down in various multiple sectors as well, metals, grains, energies, you name it, stock indices. So if you like what you see, we're gonna show you how to get involved with us in just a moment. So now it's time to meet what we call the, the quote traders of AV systems. And I will go ahead and let's see if I can make this work and I can show you my screen. Yep, we're all set. You should be looking at my screen here. This is the dashboard for AV systems. And let's go ahead and we're gonna go through the steps here. One, two, three, and four. That's what we're gonna do, walk through this here. Explore the systems. We'll show you how to subscribe to a system, then how you would activate it, and then monitor the performance of the systems that you've chosen. And the first thing you wanna notice is this table here in all the different headings, you can customize this table and you can make it appear any way you would like. You can choose, uh, for example, maybe you're not interested in some of these other categories and instead you'd like to add, you know, looking at your statistics, your Sharp, Sortino, looking at your live PNL, whatever it might be. And then of course the table now reflects what you've just chosen. You can also, sort these in ascending and descending order just by clicking on them. It's a little bit of a pause there, but you can see some of these have, um, this is annualized uh, ROI. Some of these are real, you know, obviously in ascending, descending order, you'll see the worst and the best. Some of these have big, big numbers. Anyway, we're not gonna go through all that, but just wanna point out that you can customize that table so that it can appear uh, any way you would like when you first log in. And I'll just go back to default. And the next thing you'd wanna know is, you would wanna perhaps look at this field here, and this is a good way to start, uh, or at least a way to look at uh, what systems. If you're only looking at gold, for example, just type in gold and you'll see all these gold systems, 119 of them to choose from and sort through. Uh, or maybe it's something like soybeans. Okay, so here we are looking at soybeans, see all the different uh, systems here, 22 to choose from. And I won't go on and on and beat this one to death, but let's look at crude oil. And once again, you'll see all the crude oil, there's 115. So there's currencies and there's uh, softs and stock indices, financials. And with that said, this is really the best way to do it. You go to this section here to filter and you'll notice there are quick filters and perhaps uh, this is a good one to start with. The worst drawdown for the system was less than $10,000 and it has a two plus rating. So if you click that, you'll notice, um, well, let me do this first. I'll clear it. 
you notice there's almost there's over 1900 systems available but if you use this one filter here now you have 331 so now it's filtered out everything that doesn't meet that criteria so you're kind of narrowing your universe of possibilities and then you can you can edit those uh, parameters if you'd like any way you'd like you could clear them all and this is really the most powerful tool here is the, the actually the advanced filters so instead of using just the quick filters out of these are kind of out of the box or the default filters and that's fine but these are the advanced filters here so all the performance related and descriptors here and track record and perhaps we can look at We'll go ahead and we'll add intraday. So these are day trading systems only. So there's 841. And then we can add another. Let's add another. I'm just kind of making this up as I go. Uh, we're always using the suggested capital amount. And I'll explain to the, what that means. But uh, maybe you want to look at systems that have uh, a, re a suggested capital of $25,000 uh, from $5,000 to $25,000. And so now you have 234 to choose from and so on and so forth. And I can go, well, let's look at the sharp. That's pretty high. That's ab abnormally high. Seven. Anything over one is actually pretty good in, in the institutional world. <laughs> but let's uh, let's go ahead and we'll say negative uh, negative one to two. Although I'm not sure you'd want a sharp of negative anything. So I could probably reverse that. But so now you have 174 that meet all those criteria. Uh, and if you wanted to add perhaps one more, how about percentage of time with open position? That's kind of interesting. So some of the systems are active almost all the time and that's fine. It doesn't really matter. I don't think it's really either here nor there, but perhaps uh, you're going to look at systems that trade maybe only half the time. Let's see what we end up there, how that changes the uh, the calculus. Okay, so now you're down to 174. And you can see all the criteria here that we've been filtering for. So everything's listed here. And if you wanted to change that and edit that filter, you would just go ahead and make that edit there and click OK. And then that's how you end up essentially with a much smaller universe. And if we keep filtering, we can end up with just a handful. And we're not going to go ahead and spend all that time doing it. But I just wanted to point out, this is really the, uh, the nucleus, you could, say, you could say, to the platform, this ability to filter the systems based off criteria uh, that interest you the most and that suit you the best. So this is how you can customize it. We're going to clear all these and just kind of go back to the default. Yeah, we're okay there. Now, once um, once you have filtered the systems, I'm going to go ahead and show you here. You can mark any of these as a favorite. And if they're gold, that means I've marked them as a favorite. And these are blue, and that means these are active. And I'm going to show you how that works. So for example, you've gone through the filtering and maybe there's one in particular you want to find out more about and all you simply do is look here's copper it's a swing trading system that's what the s is for it has a three uh, out of three rating which of course is a good start hd is the symbol for copper high grade copper is what that means it started here in january of 017 the total p l 130,000. winning sessions uh, 59 percent winners now Here's what you do, you just click on it. And now you can really drill down into the tear sheet. And you'll notice we're looking at all the history on this particular table here, but you could filter for any particular time frame you would like. And you'll see the name of the developer. These are professional developers. It is their job to develop algo systems for inclusion on the platform. 
And you can see the copper is the product. It's a swing trading system, meaning it's going to take uh, uh, positions and hold them overnight, uh, long or short. The cost is $75 a month, and I'll explain that in just a second. You can see this is, uh, this is a demo account. And you'll notice the performance here at the top, your total P&L, your track P&L, your live P&L, worst drawdown, suggested capital, and required capital. And I, I will explain that a little bit more in depth in just a moment. But you'll notice uh, the equity curve here. It's been doing very well since uh, inception. And you can see analyzed sessions, uh, 1,029 total P&L, annualized ROI. If you want further detail on any of these icons, you just click on here and it will give you a description. If you want to know more about the Sharp and Sortino, it's a measure of risk adjusted return is what it means. And essentially anything over uh, one or two is phenomenal. So this is at three on the Sharp. And so that's a, that's a really darn good ra ranking for the moment. So you'll see a percentage of winning sessions, your current run up since the drawdown low, so on and so forth, your best session, your worst session, on and on and on, your worst drawdown, the current drawdown. Now, I wanna point out, all of these numbers and percentages and so forth are based off of the suggested capital amount. So everything we do is based off suggested capital. And the problem is if you want to use the bare minimum, which is required capital, then your leverage dramatically increases. So that all these numbers get blown way out of proportion. So instead of a 65% ROI, um, you know, you're gonna cut this down to 5,700 instead of 50,000. Uh, 50, so your ROI is gonna expand by uh, what, eight times? And at the same time, that's great if you're making money, but that also means uh, it cuts both ways, right? So if you're on a drawdown, your drawdown is gonna be that much worse. So we always suggest uh, using, and we always do use the suggested capital. And let me explain this table here. So starting January of 2017, this particular system was back tested back to this point. That's when it very first started. It's back testing, it's hypothetical performance. And I should also point out that all of the testing always takes into account all commissions and all trading uh, cost, all the monthly license costs. So this is all, everything is net of all trading cost. So I wanna make that very, very clear. People ask and I understand, but I wanna make that clear. And you'll see the white background here means it's a back tested result. Now, when it turns this sort of tan color here, it went from being back tested to actually being placed onto the AV systems platform. And now it's being tracked on the platform and now it's visible to people um, looking and using the platform. Then when it turns green, now that means clients and, and live money has now started trading. So since uh, April of 2019, you can see this is all real money, live results, and all green since, and it's been live trading since. And let's point out something else. We looked uh, earlier in the presentation at the performance of the stock market in March. And this is one of the reasons we really love these uh, algo systems. We can look at March of this year, and it had a great result, $11,000 gain in March of this year. So let's drill down on that. On any particular month, you just click on that month, and then it will pull up. So you'll see the date of all the trading activity, your P&L on that day. Here's the cost of the license, $75. Remember here, that's how much it costs to actually trade the system. That's $75 a month. That comes directly out of your account. And now you'll see the P&L accumulated day by day. So on the 6th, you made money. On the 9th, it lost money on the 10th it made money and so on and so on and so forth. And But by the end of the month, the accumulated P&L was over $11,000. So you can see here that equity curve, uh, although just early in the month, it actually had some winners and gave it all back. So that's a good example of any trading strategy can be volatile, especially ones that generate big numbers. So you need to be aware of that and be comfortable with the idea that 
uh, some of these moves, while it might look great if you just start from here and end up here, along the way, it's not going to be a smooth ride necessarily. It can be very, very bumpy. But we, we do really, really uh, like having that diversification, uh, that non-correlated return or absolute return element with these strategies so that if you're trading, um, I'm sorry, investing in traditional assets, the correlation and the performance of these systems by and large will be completely non-correlated to anything else you're doing. And here you look at the trade log, meaning trade by trade, it will break down all the results. So everything is fully transparent. You get to see everything that's happening. For example, on the 16th here, uh, minus one, so it's it basic. It's well, it got long here on the 15th, and then it sold, and then it was flat by the end of the day. Gives you all the pricing, and you can look at it session by session or day by day. So you can see on November 30th, it was short, and it remained short on the first, on the second, so on and so forth. So it remained short that whole, whole time. Then it finally uh, bought, went flat on the ninth. And then it got in and out on the 15th. Um, anyway, so I can go deep into this, but I don't think we need to. This is just an example of really how to analyze any one particular system. They all work the same way. You can look at the chart differently. This is kind of uh, fun because you can see the scatter plot of your drawdowns and your profits here. And you can see your worst drawdown here. It's important to pay, in, pay attention to those numbers. Uh, you don't want to dismiss those drawdowns. For example, the worst drawdown, 13,000. So if you were trading this system, you put up $50,000 and it subsequently moves into a drawdown of $13,000, you have to ask yourself, are you willing to withstand that? And uh, you know, keep in mind that you, know, you have to be prepared for these types of drawdowns, especially based on the history of any system. And some systems are less volatile than others. They take smaller bites at the apple. So I'm not recommending in particular this one system. It's just one of many, but I just thought I would show it. Uh, we're looking at copper. Here's uh, silver. And it really doesn't matter uh, what market because once again, the algos do the trading for you and they don't really care if the market's moving up or down. But here is a silver trading strategy. It's another swing trading system. Uh, having a pretty big month, and this is live bunny, um, big month in December, uh, month to date, over 100,000 profits um, year to date. So that, that's a big, that's a pretty big number. But you can see again, the drawdown about 15,000 and suggested capital is higher, 95,000. And we could go on and on here is a NASDAQ system. $90,000 on this particular NASDAQ system, worst drawdown of 13,000. So to me, this looks like the, uh, the type of strategy here that it's probably not gonna trade that often. Yeah, you can tell, only trades 11% of the time. So it's, uh, it's patient, it's very patient. So it's not really active. Um, and here are, well, let me show you this then. You're asking, okay, so if you find a system you like, then what would be the next step? And I'm just kind of punting here. I'm just gonna, I don't even know what this one looks like. So it might be a complete, uh, something we bypass or I don't know, but let's look. Yeah, that's kind of a crazy looking system. There's no one trading it. So I wouldn't even go any further, but um, here, this one's interesting. I like that name, Alf. Okay, so here's a NASDAQ called ALF, suggested capital 85,000. It's uh, live trading right now, real money. And uh, let's see, worst drawdown about 19,000. Worst session 8,000, best session 88. Eight. So yeah, that's a pretty common percentage of the time with a position 27%. Now, if you wanted to trade this, here's what you do. You go to this padlock and you would buy a license. So this is what happens. This comes directly out of your, your AltaVest trading account. That's deducted right out of your account. You're doing one unit of the system. 
okay? And you would subscribe. Now this is just a demo account and I'm not even sure I have uh, enough fake money in here, so it doesn't really matter, but you would wanna read the disclaimer and you would accept. So this is how you buy that license. Now, once you bought the license, you have to activate it. Let's find out if we can activate this one or not. And if we can't, that's okay, it doesn't matter. In fact, this is part of the uh, risk control. So the risk control is you can't have an account and just start activating you know, 10 different systems at a time. Uh, it's going to check your account balance to make sure you have the capital. And let's go ahead and jump on this one. You can choose to immediately activate it or you can activate on the next session. And we're gonna do one unit, basically one contract is what that means. We'll go ahead and see if we can activate this. It may not let me, and that's okay. I'll show you what we do next. Okay, it did. And we are now active. And let's go ahead and go to phase four. And let me show you here. You'll see this here. This is your... Um, your active systems, you'll see under my systems, it's highlighted. Now, let me click this off and I'll show you how to get there. It's just up here at the top, my systems, and it'll take us to the same page. And here it is, here's the one we just added, the ALF NASDAQ, currently no positions, of course. And you can notice that I have this system here active called Atlas ES, here's another one uh, on gold, here's the ALF NASDAQ, and here's a soybean system. And the soybean is short one position right now, accumulated profits so far of over $2,200. We just initiated and activated ALF here, and that's uh, uh, currently flat, of course, not doing anything. You can see the live trading here overnight. If this were in the middle of the day, you'd see a lot of these flashing and a lot more excitement, but uh, we're a little bit off to, after hours, so and then here's gold, accumulated profit on that, 1700. And then this uh, E-mini S&P 500, accumulated profit so far, $175. And it will show you here the last trade. I don't know what it was, but uh, here it is, all the details. So you can see all the fills for your last trades. And you could go back in time if you wanted. And now you can also see any orders. So there are no outstanding orders for that uh, particular system. Let me go here and look at this one. We're short. And here are the fills. Basically, it went short at 12.23 and a half. So it gives you the price there. And there are no other existing orders on that particular um, system at the moment. So that is how simple it is to monitor your performance. Now here's the next question and the next thing you need to know. You are trading, this, this algo is trading for you right now, this one. And perhaps for whatever reason, you'd like to deactivate it. Maybe you think uh, that's enough accumulated profit on that system. And for whatever reason, you think it's not going to perform well in the future or whatever. Uh, so you click here and you would simply stop strategy. And then it gives you the opportunity to exit that position the next time the market opens or simply maintain that position until the system actually closes it out for you uh, based on its, uh, its own logic and its, uh, its existing um, risk management. And that's all you have to do. And then you would then click uh, accept and then deactivate. And that's it. So it's one click activation and deactivation with these buttons here. And then um, that will remove it out of your My Systems. Now let's jump. We talked about top 10 in the very beginning. I think it's the opening slide. So here's what you do. This is a fun site here, a page. Okay, this is the current session, so it's already beginning for tomorrow. So this is current meaning uh, for overnight and tomorrow since today's already ended and uh, trading 
parlance. <laughs> and these are the top 10. In fact, that silver system we looked at on the home page uh, looks like it's the best performer so far today. And it's long a contract from 26, 13 and a half. Yeah, so that's the one we saw doing great uh, month to date, of course. And here's a bond system. Here's an E-mini S&P 500. Here's the Euro and here's the NASDAQ. So these are your top 10 uh, performers uh, as we speak just for today. You can see it flashing. You can see all the numbers flashing as the uh, P&L gets adjusted. It tells you you're long or you're short from what price, where your stop orders are, where the limit orders are. You know, let's look at uh, this Euro number eight. I'm just randomly picking one here. I really don't know. $30,000 suggested capital and it's fairly limited with live performance, but sometimes that's okay because we do find the live performance does track very, very closely uh, with the hypothetical back-tested performance. I want to point out again that all the back-tested performance already takes into account all trading cost and all slippage. So they're very conservative in their back testing. They, they account for a lot of slippage so that there are no surprises when you're trading it uh, for real. All right, and let's look at the previous session. So that would have been today. It was a DAC system, a mini S&P, mid cap, NASDAQ, so forth, here's silver. So this is the performers from uh, basically earlier today. Last month, here's last month, you can see the NASDAQ here, um, silver, gold. So mid cap, some of your better perform or best performers really for last month. So and you can go back and looking back last year or since inception to 2001. So it's kind of a, a fun page to start with. And if you want some ideas, you can always start with the top 10. Well, let me jump here. Looks like there's some chat going on here. Give me one second. There's actually, there was a bunch of questions coming in. And just bear with me as I scan some of this here. Okay. Someone's asking about solar cycle. Someone's asking about commissions. Um, or let's see, I will, or wait, no, not commissions. Um, yeah, so you can look at, let me just close that out real quickly. In terms of looking at systems that have perhaps a, a lower amount of suggested capital, the way you would do that is simply go up to the advanced filters here and let's see what we get with anywhere from 5,000 to 10,000. So there are 38 systems that have a suggested capital of anywhere from five to $10,000. So hopefully that helps answer that question. All right, so I could go on a little bit further, but I think, uh, I think that covers the basic uh, outlook here. And if there's anything I missed, I think that really offers uh, a, an overview here to show you what this is all about. It's a lot of fun to use. It's a very powerful tool. And you would want to use this filtering mechanism here to find systems uh, that really suit you best. Um, you know, quite frankly, people look at you know, the annualized ROI a lot of times, and they'll just say, well, what's the best performer here? 473%, you know, I wanna do that one. <laughs> and uh, maybe, maybe that's okay, but I don't know, not a lot of history on this one yet. And just started with live money here in December. And this is just an example. And uh, so that might be okay, but really it's up to you to decide on what you're comfortable with. and. Let me go ahead and grab a couple of the comments here. Yes, yeah, someone's mentioning, is it really uh, activate with one click or deactivate? Yes, yes, absolutely. Uh, like I said, you, you activate it and you walk away. And I wouldn't forget it. 
I wouldn't walk away and forget about it because you still want to monitor your performance, but uh, you don't have to do anything. And it really does remove a lot of the emotion from the whole, um, you know, from the, the whole setup because uh, you don't have to oversee it and screen watch. And let me go ahead and switch screens again. Just one second. Someone asked about, there's a bunch of other questions here. Uh, the question about brokerage, we are the brokerage firm. So this is technology you would use uh, with us as the brokerage firm. All right, let me switch screens here. And it's a very powerful tool and clients absolutely love using it. That much I can tell you. Okay. Are we seeing this kid here with the fire hose, drinking from the fire hose? If anyone can uh, confirm that you're seeing what I'm seeing, let me know you're able to see that. Yep, got it, okay. So hopefully it didn't feel like you're drinking from the fire hose, but here's the comment we get. I love it, I wanna do it, but the only thing is I've never traded futures. Well, you know what, it really, shouldn't make a difference. And why is that? Well, we just talked about it. The algos do the trading for you. That's the whole point of this, so that you don't have to screen watch. The algos do the trading for you. It doesn't matter what the market is, crude oil, and the Nikkei index, the Russell, silver, NASDAQ, S&P, Dow, bonds, copper, gold, whatever it is. The algos do the work trading in any up or down environment. Stock index futures, that's a real big one that we love to have exposure to. Uh, metals as well, energies, currencies, the euro is a good one. So why futures contracts? Where they're, they offer um, you know, deep liquidity, markets trade, uh, you can trade on the DAX futures actually, um, the German stock market index, they're transparent, they offer leverage, diversification opportunity. Uh, these systems go long or short, and they are cost effective. So we think AV Systems is the answer, <laughs> the solution that you've been looking for that you probably did not know uh, even existed. And it is actually a lot of fun to use as well. Now here's how to get started, folks. This is what we call our membership offer. So with AV Systems, it's our automated futures trading solution and it really is full automation. 20 years of R&D, a lot of time and effort, expense and so forth went into this. Dozens of professional systems uh, developers and programmers. There are now almost, what, 1900 systems and we call them bots or robots on the platform, trading in US and even some overseas markets and multiple market sectors. And you see that switch there on and off, yes. Uh, it really is in some ways that easy completely transparent trading. It shows you exactly what's happening. It's not hiding what's happening. So you get to see your open positions. You get to see where any current outstanding orders are and where they're, you know, where they're placed. You see the orders moving as the machines uh, move your stops and your limit orders for you. You're in full control to turn anything off or on with automated risk and profit management. There's intraday and swing trading systems. Sometimes, uh, there are traders that want to be out overnight or over the weekend, so they don't have any surprises. Uh, look what happened this morning. But of course that can work for you as well, but or against you. Uh, swing trading systems as well, either way, it's up to you. You can review your um, live system performance, of course, looking at the history. And there's also all that performance history I didn't show you, but you can download that. So global stock indices, currencies, financial markets, metals, energies, you saw it, grains. So to hire one programmer, to build one algorithm, to trade one market, just to do one system, over $10,000. And how do we know that? Well, we've spent hundreds of thousands of dollars working with developers and futures and FX trading systems. It's a costly and time consuming uh, process. Trust us, we know. So you're also gonna get our A-list. Those are the top picks that we, uh, that we offer. You'd wanna know if your systems are on the A-list. We work with clients to allocate various systems 
uh, and through various sectors and markets and whatnot. So those are our top picks. That proprietary research, $2,952. So you have the AV Systems platform that we just saw. You have our A-list research. And then you have a private coach. This is how we bring it all together for you. So we don't just leave you alone, unattended, um, and you know, on your own, kind of in the corner. So one-on-one -on -one training with a Series 3 licensed, experienced broker. One-hour screen sharing sessions. That's how we train you. So you share the screen with the, the advisor. Some of the things they'll talk about, filtering for the systems, activating and deactivating, you know, if you want to get out of the market or take the next signal or whatever it might be, uh, looking at those A-list selections we already spoke about, uh, diversifying your systems across various types, uh, not only necessarily just an intraday or swing, but some of them are, are long only, for example, or short only. Some are very, very active, take small bites at the apple. Others uh, take a bigger swing at the plate. So it just depends, but we can work with you on refining that and harnessing that. So you have these onboarding sessions, you have a co-pilot, uh, you'll work with a licensed person. These are not, we, we're not just chat bots. We've been doing this for decades, folks. Um, a lot of people on the internet, you know, they can say anything, but we can't, we're the real deal. We've been here doing this and we're a brokerage firm, we're regulated, we're licensed. And with, uh, with that said, that value there for that person to work with you at least $7,500, at least. In fact, I would say that uh, I know for sure, I hear about it. I hear people tell me they've spent $25,000 on some sort of education and there's nothing wrong with getting educated, but what we're telling you is we include that as part of your membership package. So you get AV systems and the A-list research and your private coach, a value of over $21,000, and I, I think it's that one thing that's really going to work for you if you're looking into automated trading or even if you're not and you're thinking this is my aha moment, uh, we think it can be that one thing that works for you where we know it can save you a lot of time. Maybe you can cancel other subscriptions that you're paying for. I think it could be uh, very beneficial in lowering that screen watching time, lower your stress. And when I say people have paid tens of thousands for algo systems, you bet it. You bet. Uh, even years ago, I would talk to people that were spending $50,000. There was a group in a, a systems firm, I think out of Texas, somewhere in New Jersey, you name it. People are spending $25,000, $50,000 for these trading systems. Uh, a lot, a lot of money. And they're still doing it to this day. But with us, what we're saying is we can bypass all that. We've used uh, technology. We've sort of uh, commoditized the algo trading, you should say. And so it is a live event, a live webinar. Here's our special offer here. So AV Systems membership, $997. In fact, we've offered it at $1997 in events uh, all around the country, people signing up. We've lowered the, uh, the uh, membership. And in fact, we'll do even better. I'm using the red and green here for, for Christmas. <laughs> Here's our Christmas discount before Sunday night. This is, this is the, the real deal, folks. <laughs> a lifetime AV Systems member, and this is just a one-time payment, okay? One-time payment, 497. And there's the link, cf.altavest.com forward slash AVS. There's our phone number if you had any other comments or questions, uh, but quite frankly, people just go to the link, sign up, and we begin the onboarding process. And really, there's no excuse. As with any good offer, there's a guarantee. So you have no risk on that membership fee. You have no risk, you have nothing to lose. And if it's not right for you, if it's not a good fit for you next month, tell us and we'll refund the money gladly. No issues, no trouble. 30 day guarantee on that. And if you're looking for a free membership with uh, $50,000 or more, you can uh, get that rebate uh, to uh, that, that membership fee rebated. Now here's another thing, stick with me here and we're gonna get uh, into the final stretch. Uh, there, here's some things you don't know for sure. Uh, maybe some of you do, but a lot of people don't. We can lower your tax rate by over 10%. Why? Because futures, this is where you wanna trade folks. You wanna be in futures and futures uh, are tax efficient, that's why. Here's an article to Barron's, tax advantage 1256 contracts. 
So that blended rate, that 60-40 rate, meaning 60% of your gains are taxed at the shorter, uh, I'm sorry, the lower uh, rate, which is the long-term rate, and then 40% are taxed at your uh, personal rate. But that's basically a combo rate that's 10 percentage points lower uh, compared to if you were just trading stocks. So how does that work? Here, you're trading stocks, 100 grand, 20% return. You're going to pay 7,400 in tax, a rate of return of 12.6%. So if you're trading with us, that same return, you're going to pay only $5,360 in tax. 14.64% return, tax savings of over $2,000, simply because you're trading in a different instrument. And this is where all the activity is. This is where the, the uh, I guess you could say, the, the volume in many ways, not every futures market though is as, as liquid as, as the other, but certainly the stock index uh, futures, which is where we really, really like to focus. And also there's no more itemizing. You receive a 1099, uh, which, which is your, uh, your P&L, and that's it. You don't have wash sales and all that nonsense. So with AV Systems, it's easy, a user-friendly platform. You saw how easy it is. There's no screen watching. Um, we mentioned, you know, someone said set it and forget it, and I put it in here, but, you know, let's use the word forget it uh, with a little uh, tongue-in-cheek there. Uh, you don't want to ever forget your money, right? But experience matters. Uh, decades of development with these systems. And I think alternatives are the place to be. You'd want to lower the risk, right, of your portfolio. They have a low correlation to traditional investments and may improve diversification and lower that portfolio risk. It could improve the risk return profile of a portfolio. And it says alternatives provide access to a broader set of investments and strategies beyond traditional investments may help grow an investor's total return. And it's a diversified portfolio. Alternatives can help smooth the impact of market volatility and may generate higher returns relative to their level of risk over time. So that's the whole idea, having that diversification having that alternative asset class working for you in a non-correlated manner, also called absolute return. And this is kind of funny. I saw this a few weeks ago. I, I threw it in here. Uh, Jim Rogers, he worked, uh, well, he's made billions of dollars trading, I would suspect, uh, with the quantum fund in the 70s and even since then. But he says it's good to be old. Young people have a bleak future ahead of them. So he's a, he's a bit cynical right now in the future. Um, and I kind of threw it in there thinking, I, yeah, I think that's probably a good argument for, for you know, having some exposure to alternatives. I think that's kind of what he's saying. And remember, we looked at this earlier. You can see what happens here to the stock market. It can happen anytime, and it may not necessarily have a V recovery next time. I mean, there are plenty of periods in history where, you know, you get 10 or 20 year periods and the market is flat. And, you know, I think in those, in those occasions, uh, you're gonna probably want exposure to other uh, opportunities such as the futures markets and, and what we just looked at. So non-correlation, that's what we call it. That's what uh, we offer and uh, allocation to alternative assets and investments. We like the futures, automated systems. And here's portfolio one, two, and three. We like number three. You have that small slice of the pie there for alternatives. We think we can be a good, um, a good option for you there. And uh, we'd love to work with you and talk with you more about that. So here's uh, some of us having dinner with some clients and we'd love to have you on board with us if you're serious about your success. And here's how we're gonna wrap it up here. Basically, just leave that up there for you. Remember, it's a one-time payment. It's one time. It's not quarterly or annually or whatever. People always ask that too. 497, 30 day guarantee on that. So if you think it's even remotely something that you wanna do, uh, certainly go to the link there and we'll be glad to get you started and, and onboarded. So let's see if there are any further questions. Let me take a look here. Talking about option strategies. Yes, we do trade option strategies. We have a proprietary technology that trades non-directional option strategies. So someone asked that, and so absolutely we do that. In fact, that's uh, really 
we do AV systems, and we have our other uh, options strategy as well. Uh, and you're gonna wanna see that too. So certainly reach out to us if you wanna know more about our proprietary uh, option strategy. We use a trade alert functionality that comes directly to your device and that's integrated with your account. So you don't have to log into some other device or copy something. Uh, so we have some pretty uh, clever technology there. And yeah, these algo trades um, that we looked at, AV Systems works with us as your brokerage firm. So everything is integrated with your brokerage firm, us. And let's take a look here. Someone like the monkey. Yes, I thought that was a clever picture of the monkey trading. <laughs> and in terms of who chooses the market to trade and whatnot, well, uh, that is essentially up to you. So a system is developed for a particular market and then it, uh, it you know, then you, you now have access to that particular system. So uh, you saw how it looked, what it looked like there in the, um, in the demo where there might've been a particular system on silver with a particular name. So that might've been one of 25 different systems that traded the silver market. So hopefully that answers that. And precautions to take. Well, I think it's essentially looking at the history of a, of a, of a particular system and what is the maximum drawdown and suggested capital. And that kind of gives you an idea of how volatile it may or may not be. And I don't have time to show you our, our option strategy, but uh, every system is different in terms of the monthly cost. Some are $20 and some are maybe $100 and for the license fee. And yeah, it's charges if you wanna do say three contracts of a particular system and it's uh, say $50 a month, then it would be $150 per month. That's correct. And if you do multiple, I think they, get, they give you breaks. Well, I know they do because we do it. So sometimes the developer will say, if you do five units of this system, instead of paying $50 for each one, you could have all five for $100. So they give kind of the, the bulk rate discount. In capital, we like 50,000 to start with. And most popular algorithm, I don't think there really is the most popular algorithm. Uh, and let's take a look here. I think the algos, uh, we have ones that we like, certainly, but uh, you know, people of course have different preferences and you know, any of the ones that have live trading, you know, obviously are gonna be your starting point if you just wanna look at uh, what is the most popular. All right, and yes, you'll wanna, someone just send, uh, mentioned numbers like drawdown capital requirements and so forth. Yeah, you wanna look at that and you want to drill down into any of those numbers. So if you're more focused on what are the um, drawdown numbers, you want to filter for that and so on and so forth. All right, no, nothing to buy. It's all internet related, all web-based, nothing else to do. All right, great. I think I'm out of time. So thanks for joining me and uh, Merry Christmas and Happy New Year. <laughs>